Welcome to my channel, Technology in the Future. Therefore, Google demonstrated with the Pixel 8 that generative AI will dominate the smartphone industry. Back then, I predicted that Google may have an edge over Samsung and Apple because they had adopted the technology first, but it now appears that may not be the case. With the Galaxy S24 Ultra, Samsung has embraced generative AI to the fullest. They're funding AI firms like US-based Irreverent Labs, a specialist in 3D content AI, creating their own language model powered by AI, and collaborating with Qualcomm and Meta to add Llama 2 LLM to the S24 portfolio. In essence, the S24 Ultra is slated to provide the biggest AI update in Samsung phone history, and some people are referring to it as the AI phone like Ice Universe. You're undoubtedly asking, what this means for average people like myself at this point. Therefore, incorporating generative AI into phones has the potential to fundamentally alter how we use them. With the Pixel 8, Google has already hinted at some amazing features like significantly improved ATR, a magic editor, improved zoom, night mode for videos, and a highly intelligent Google Assistant. Additionally, generative AI may produce incredibly individualized user interfaces giving your phone the appearance of a personalized assistant. We've only begun to scratch the surface of what is feasible. Think about how your phone may compose and reply to emails on your behalf. It's getting easier and easier to accomplish with AI operating directly on your smartphone. The Galaxy S24 is Samsung's entry into this market, and it will be interesting to see how they handle it. Given their significant expenditures in AI, the S24 lineup will undoubtedly transform the game. The S24 Ultra will use the Snapdragon chip globally, whilst the S24 and S24 Plus will use the standard Snapdragon slash Exynos split depending on the area, as you may have just heard. A Geekbench listing for the S24 Ultra for Europe effectively confirms that the S24 Ultra will really contain the Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 chip in Europe, which is a major relief. As a result, this is no longer a rumor. The Snapdragon chip will be included with the S24 Ultra not only in Europe, but throughout the rest of the world. Next, one of the major highlights of Apple's iPhone 15 event was how the latest pro iPhone could natively run a console titles like Resident Evil, Assassin's Creed Mirage, and more. And if you were wondering if Samsung will also do the same with the Galaxy S24 Ultra, then the answer is yes. You'll be able to play these contemporary games without having to download and install them on the S24 range, according to South Korean media outlet the Korea Economic Daily, which also adds that Samsung will bring select AAA titles to the S24 Ultra through cloud gaming. Therefore, all you require is a dependable, quick internet connection. Although Samsung may charge a little price for this, it will still be among the less expensive cloud gaming options available. The good part is you can start playing right away with a monthly cost, unlike Apple, where you have to buy and download the game. With that said, do subscribe for all the latest content on the S24, and I'll see you tomorrow. Peace out.